The papal delegate to the Legion of Christ, Archbishop Velasio de Paulus, is the person responsible for the congregation. Vatican Secretary of State Tarcisio Bertone clarified this in a decree sent to the order to explain the delegate's role. Velasio de Paulus exercises authority on behalf of the Pope over all the legionaries of Christ, from its general director, Alvaro Coquera, to its last religious. While de Paulus is delegate, the superiors of the institute will remain in office, but will have to run their decisions by the papal delegate. He will then decide whether or not to approve them. The delegate can denounce acts of the superiors of the institute if he considers it necessary. The Holy See reserves the ability to relieve the superiors without having to explain why. Bertoni clarified in the document that the main task of the delegate is to direct, monitor, and carry out the revision of the constitutions. Bertone says that a committee must be formed as soon as possible to review the constitution. De Paulus will chair the committee and it will include participation of all the members of the congregation. If the delegate sees the need to study and broaden certain topics, whether of people or things, study commissions can be undertaken. De Paulus will not be alone in developing this work. He will enlist the help of four close advisors who have yet to be named. The advisors specifically will visit other communities. This decree, reviewed by Benedict XVI, leaves no doubt of the role of Archbishop Velasio de Paulus. He will have the important task of solving the grave problems caused by the congregation's founder, Marcial Maciel. <laughs>